with us uh, Omer Bavaros Yis, who is the Chief Marketing Officer at uh, Turkcell. Turkcell is the fastest growing telecom in the world. Yeah. And uh, we're very fortunate to have uh, its, its CMO with us to uh, help us understand some of the things going on in the market today. Yeah, sure. uh, we have seen uh, incredible uh, uh, growth in uh, WTTX. Uh, can you tell us what you see in terms of the 2C and 2H markets? Yeah, sure. Uh, as you stated, Turkcell is the fastest growing telecom operator in the world thanks to the increasing data demand after the introduction of 4.5G in Turkey. And WTTX is also an important part of our business. Uh, we had the chance to optimize our ROI pattern in the collaboration with Huawei in the last year, and we have achieved great sales numbers on the WTTX front. And we had the chance to introduce unlimited data packages. It's a great value in Turkey, there is no quota on the WTTX front, thanks to the network optimization efforts. And we are doing great, and it has an important place in our plans also for 2019, I can say. Terrific, terrific. And as the fastest growing in terms of revenue telecom, yeah. can you tell us about Huawei's role and relationship uh, in making that success possible? Uh, you know, in order to grow fast, you have to uh, efficiently use your resources. So. One of the resources, maybe the most important one, is the network resources. So you have to use your capacity very smartly and Huawei is an important partner from this perspective. Can you talk to us about uh, Blue Ocean, which is uh, the uh, public cloud and uh, the enterprise market, mm -hmm. and what Turkcell's overall ideas are about it? Yeah, sure. Uh, one of the areas also we have achieved a very good growth rate is the enterprise market last year and it still continues to grow, by the way. The important thing is to enhance the communication between the ecosystem partners and the verticals, and we need to promote upgrades in the enterprise ecosystem. Enterprise markets is a little bit different from the consumer markets, so you have to concentrate your marketing efforts a little bit differently in the, in the enterprise domain. So especially uh, ICT products, these cloud things, the security uh, operation things, the data center things uh, have a great potential to grow and we will continue to work on that. And how do you see Huawei as a partner in that, in that collaboration and that growth? Yeah, uh, as I said, uh, cloud is one of the most important things and Huawei has a big domain on this front and we are working closely also with Huawei. Uh, on, in the enterprise markets. And, and do you find with, with Huawei's expertise in artificial intelligence and mm -hmm. uh, it, it's, its global reach, that, that, that creates advantages too for you? Yeah, exactly. We are closely working uh, with the vendors and Huawei is one of them. And uh, as I said, the digitalization maturity is, is slowly growing in many markets. And also this is the case in Turkey. And on the enterprise markets, we are seeing more tendency to use digital products, and so these partnerships will be extremely important in the enterprise ecosystem. Wonderful. We're here at the Mobile World Conference in Barcelona, where everyone is talking about 5G. Yeah. And everyone's talking about 5G, but right before the Mobile World Con uh, Congress began, Huawei in London demonstrated uh, the first multi-partner uh, 5G video. Mm -hmm. And so 5G video and 5G as a technology is now primed for commercial use. Can you talk to us about your thoughts and Turkcell's thoughts on 5G and what it, what it means for yeah, all of us? Yeah, sure. I, I can say that we continue our talks, conversations also in Barcelona. It is in our daily lives. Uh, every day we are talking about uh, how 5G uh, brings more opportunities uh, in our lives. And having the broadest bandwidth uh, in the Europe uh, we have the ability to deliver 1.2 gigabit per second even in our 4.5G spectrum because we have this spectrum mm -hmm. and we are saying that in Turkey we are 5G ready and uh, when the time comes 5G will be in the place uh, in Turkey. I also saw many things especially in the Huawei boot here. It is extremely exciting I can say. Uh, nice. The fishing <laughs> thing, the gaming thing, everything makes me very excited. But as a marketer, from the marketing perspective, I can say that not only from the product uh, point of view, 
Many things will change in the marketing industry and especially media consumption habits. Uh, also, there will be a lot of migration to digital world and we will see many people to spend most of their time in the digital world. So 5G will be the key in our uh, business model. We are all excited and to see the developments, recent developments here makes us even more excited, I can terrific, say. Terrific, terrific. Uh, and Turkey right now is going through incredible economic growth mm -hmm. and it really has a, this economic engine. 5G is, is going to do dynamic things, and your partnership with, with Huawei, how do you see that helping the economy in, in Turkey as well? What we have seen is uh, there is a big transition, you know, in the last 10, 15 years. There was an edge technology, then we uh, introduced 3G, and then we introduced 4.5G, and even in every transition, we see a rapid growth, we see a rapid economic development, and what we expect is, uh, again, an another jump after the introduction of 5G. And as you see this collaboration between Turkcell and Huawei bringing to market uh, 5G technologies, what, what do you see for businesses in terms of new opportunities? Yeah, I can say that we talked about WTTX and we will talk about uh, fixed wireless access. So we will be at home with great speeds I believe, and it's a big opportunity, even in the consumer market and in the, in the enterprise market. And we collaborated, we achieved success, and 5G will be another success story in the coming future. Congratulations on your great success and your okay. collaboration. Thank you. Appreciate it, thank you.